Howdy, oh, what do you know? This is Rabbit of Scrublead Academy, and we are back in Dido today, back in Dungeons and Dragons Online, and we're going to go ahead and farm out some trogs today. So where I want to go for these is Acid Wit. I find this one to be probably the best, and you can find some decent earth elementals in here too. But we'll just go ahead and start zooming through. We've got a few bats at the beginning, a few acid stones. We'll get rid of you. And there's our first trog kill right there. So they come about pretty quickly. I'm just kind of swinging wildly as I bring a few in. As you can tell, we've got some decent kills here. So we'll go ahead and get rid of you. We do actually have to destroy these acid stones to complete the quest, but really our mission objective here isn't so much to complete the quest as just to kill some trogs. So we're bringing a few in here. We might as well clean them up just to get those kills out of the way, just for the sake of it. You know what? Let's check it out. So what do we got here? We've got 971 so far. So let's just go ahead and see how long it takes us to get to the end of this dungeon and try and reduce the amount of kills that we've got here. Alrighty. Oh. Oh, jeez. Burning blood. Ew. Melf's acid arrow and burning blood. Just these acid dots. Terrible, terrible stuff. Alright, so can we get through this? Well, we'll just burn through a few of these guys. Hit this lever up. Come on, you. There we go. Alright, open this place up, and let's just go right through here. Let's not even bother. We'll just gather a few of them up. Oh my goodness, the lag is real. Uh, the lag is real. There we go. All right, let's go, let's go. Yeah, there we go. We're getting that alert together. We're actually getting it together. This corridor ends at an ornate yet ghastly door. Why, oh why, for the lag? Come on. Yeah, let's go all the way down there. We've examined. Now let's kill these guys before the lag ends up taking us down. Let's get rid of them. Let's get rid of them. There we go. So we got rid of most of what was pursuing us. There we go. Got rid of all of our alert, too. And decent elementals. Decent. Let's get rid of them. There we go. So we'll need to go through both of these levers on the sides. We're not quite at the best area for this one. So I'm going to keep going and see what we can get together. A few more of these. Very nice. Um, the acid can be dangerous if you are not... Well, if you're not a rogue and doesn't who doesn't have evasion? If you're not a rogue or someone who has evasion, then yes, they can get really dangerous. But also, if you don't have any resistance or if you're farming these at level, it's probably wiser not to run through them like I did. That said, we can start cleaning through. Pretty easy mode here. There we go. And oh look, nice hunter. Now it's way, way quicker to go ahead and farm on any range tune. It always has been, probably always will be, uh, especially a tune that's got some decent AoE. If you've got some area effect, you can crush everything in here with ease. Alrighty, so we'll go ahead and clean these guys out because this is kind of what we're doing here anyway, and we don't want to have a train following us that's moving slow. So we've got Trog Exterminator 3, which is telling us we're getting a little further ahead. What are we at right now? Uh, 1,001 on the solo. Alrighty, so let's get rid of these guys. Get rid of him. He's not going to move, so we'll get rid of him. And we'll take him out just so that we don't have too much of a train following us. So we technically have four different paths that we have to head down to open that big door. And as soon as we open the big door, we'll have a decent run of trogs going back the way we came from. Alrighty, so, boom. Bring them through the lava. Alrighty. That was a little interesting. There we go. Zoom, zoom, zoom. And we see a bundle more of these guys. So we're just going to go ahead, go up here, grab that fungus. And just punch our way out of this grouping here. Alrighty. Oh, jeez. We're going to have to get rid of some of these guys. There we go. A little easier. Oh my goodness. Stop standing in my back. Ah, there we go. All right, we can get in here now. Nice. All right, punch through everything. Just crush it. Crush it, crush it, crush it. And wow, he really didn't want to die. 
There we go. Ah. No, you don't. No, you... Ah, burning blood. Ew. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. It's not going to do all that much. We'll heal over it. So we've opened the first half there. We've we've turned all the switches for the red crystal. But now we need to go and get the orange crystal. And I might just go ahead and zoom through this. Let's see what we've got beforehand. we got 10, 24 before. So let's go ahead and see what we've got after. And after a surprisingly laggy experience, we're at 1056, and this is where we wanted to be. So we're going to go ahead and go through all of these guys here, gather them all together, because what we really want to do is just go ahead and farm out that there boss right there. We'll just go ahead and get all these guys and just clean sweep through. So we can go downstairs get the acid stone. I don't know if the mobs end up despawning after this guy dies, so let's check it out. So we got 1059. After he dies... Ah, there we go, he's in the middle. And we got him. Alright, I don't think they do. Good. That's good. So we can still kill off all these trogs as we've got him here. Alrighty, awesome. Alrighty, this is perfect, so we can actually showcase this a little bit. Because I believe this scripted event takes, what, a minute to to go through? And as soon as it goes through, we have a few more trogs here. So I'll see you on the other side for those guys. Alrighty, and there we are. So it looks like we're getting um we're getting closer to the to the opening of this little rock wall here. So, excellent. I'm going to hang out down here because it prompts everybody to come down here to meet me. And I think that's probably for the best. Yeah, so we got a decent amount of them there. Come on down, and we'll just start slaughtering them. Just start owning them as soon as they get down here. Ah, burning blood. Alright, so there we go. So, a decent amount of them there. What did we get? 12 more trogs there? And I think they have another spawn. I believe that they do. Yes, they do. So they're actually going to spawn in some to deal with us because we are such a nuisance to this poor Trog clutch. I think that's what you would call them, is a clutch. And we can just clean them out as we do. So very easy. Sequential. And this is probably the best place to actually get your trogs at the end. It's like a little reward at the end of this whole thing. So let's get rid of them as they come in. Very nice. A few more. And there's another one right there. We'll get rid of him and him. And I think we might be nearing the end here. We might be nearing the end, but still. Yep, we did. That was all that we had there. Still very nice. So we popped off at 1,100 exactly on our character, which is very decent. So that's like 100 trogs here, I think, isn't it? I'm going to have to check that out, but I, I was sure that we were at 1,000 before. Or just slightly above, honestly. Still, very decent number in here. This is the place that I tend to go, and it's usually for that event there that you really want to hold out. Because this event is probably your best generation of trogs in the whole region, even though you can run through the whole thing really quickly. But that's all the time we have for that one. Troglodytes are an interesting one, but as I say, that's probably the best place to farm. Or at least that's the best place I've found to farm them. So why don't you guys go ahead and leave a comment and mention where you think some place might be that may have a few more trogs. Or if you've just got anything to say, it's always nice to hear what you guys think about these kind of things. Either than that, I'm going to get up out of here, and I will see you all next time. Bye-bye for now.